was high as a kite Late night, Christmas Eve, would you believe? Some niggas came to the mo with tricks up under they sleeve I was so deep that I wasn't paying attention Till I saw that chrome shining, then I heard that bitch just snitching Got a nigga hit, then cuts, what the fuck could it be? I am the Nordis I thought around this time of year these niggas will be joyous No way Hey, what up you guys? It's Danny B. You're watching The Trash Dish. In this video, I'm going to be reviewing The Pornographer. Later, as I watched one of my uncle's videos, I saw more than just sex. I saw a world where girls did whatever you wanted. Where they didn't laugh at you. They didn't walk away from you. But lately, something wasn't right. I wanted something different. This is a review I'm going to be doing for part of my uh, Triple x Miss series. Now, this one is one I saw in Showtime back in like 2005, 2006. And for some reason, it just always stuck with me. Like, I always kind of remembered it. But I haven't watched it in like... 15 years or something like that and this movie was actually a lot better than I remember this one almost kind of has like a vibe like a Brian De Palma film and um, You know it actually kind of makes sense because it, it was produced by uh, Craig Wasson who starred in um, Body Double I'm sorry if you guys can hear that they're doing like construction outside and this was just kind of a low-budget type of movie And so what it's about is this guy who's a lawyer and He's kind of lonely and he's like going to like all these strip clubs and hookers and he has a big collection of porn like, He's not good at talking to people like he tries to ask girls out at his office and He does it in the stupidest way like he doesn't establish any kind of like rapport with them or anything He just goes like hey, do you like plays? Let's go to play Miserable. He basically, you know, he has no game at all Hi Have you have you seen my Miserable? <laughs> what? It, it, it's gonna it's gonna be playing here this Friday night and and, and I got I got two tickets to see it and, and I was wondering, you know, um, um, and maybe you'd like to go. Um, uh, I'm sorry. I, I really can't. Oh. Then after a while, he starts kind of making his own films, and he does such a good job at it that he gets this deal with this um, porn company. And that's where Craig Wasson comes in, who you might remember him from Body Double. He's super sleazy in this. Like, he's playing, like, one of the slimiest characters. He looks like, um, the guy from Office Space, Lumberg. But, it, like, imagine that guy, but is really just sleazy and manipulative. That's my proposition. You want to make movies for me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> want to use these sound stages and equipment and everything? Work with the stars? Yes, yes. Find me a girl. Somebody new. Somebody special. Not some horror off the streets of Hollywood. I'm talking about good old fashioned down on the farm. Cheerleader USA. Girl next door. Find me a girl like that and I'll let you make a movie with two hours of me then. <laughs> you find me a girl like that, I'll make you a star. And then his life kind of takes a downward spiral from there. And I won't say what happens. But this is an excellent movie. Uh, if you can find it, it's probably easier to find on VHS than DVD. This was directed by Doug Atchison, who I think only did this one and maybe one other movie. Oh, and Penny is in this movie. Uh, the girl that played Penny in Showgirls, she's in this. If you like character study movies, this is kind of like, you know, like Taxi Driver, but like the porno version. And it's not got like actual porn in it. It's just like about a porn guy. Yeah, this is a pretty underrated one. I'm going to give this one four out of five stars. It's a pornographer. All right, guys, this is Danny B. You're watching The Trash Dash. Let me know you've seen The Pornographer. Let me know some others like it. If you know, hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.